Welcome guys, it is the X-Man here and we are back in Oxford Evolved with some more Empire Jet Boy! So today I kind of uh, feel like doing a little bit of attack. Uh, I don't remember the last time we actually did like a full-on raid uh, where like people would come back and attack us. Well, I feel like today should be that day. So uh, looking at the map as we logged on, uh, it looks like no one really took any land back. We've managed to take this line down here from Babylon. So what I want to do, I kind of want to take that bit of the beach back. The fight that we always have with the Babylon is always on that beach. So what I want to do, I want to probably take a lot of these with us. Um, not sure about the Kentris. May, may, may take a couple of them. But yeah, going to take the Crab, going to take the Arthro. Uh, maybe a few of the Spinos, some Aloes, some Rexes. Um, I believe there's a couple of Babylons on, so I'm sure they will come and uh, fight us and stuff. So it could be... Uh, could be entertaining. Uh, I just feel like we need to let them know that we have not given up that bit of land yet. Um, and I just kind of want to, I want to fight. I'm feeling angry today and I want to destroy a tribe. <laughs> so yeah, that's going to be the plan of action. Um, and then we'll see what else kind of happens like we normally do. Sometimes we end, it ends up being a whole episode of fighting. Sometimes it's like a five minute thing and then we have to go off and do other stuff. So we'll see how it goes. So uh, if you do enjoy it at any point, don't forget to smash the thumbs up button, subscribe, ring the bell and enable notifications. Follow the social medias. Uh, it's all really appreciated. And then question of the day is going to be a nicely, a nice simple one. What is everyone's favorite food? Now, this can be you just like carrots. This could be a whole ass meal, like you like to have a, a Sunday roast or a curry or something. So let me know down below what everyone's uh, favorite food is. So now I need to pick out exactly what we want. So what I'll probably do, I'll probably make a couple of trips because we've got to take stuff from here down to there. So I'm probably going to take the crab and uh, maybe, can we take like two off rows maybe? God damn, that sun's bright. I'm pretty sure we can pick two up. We'll see if we can take the crab and two arthros. Uh, let's see if we can pick them up. Excuse me, I want to ride you, mister. Okay, so left, hold right, left click. And then we come over here and hold right click on you. Should we be able to pick another one up? Oh, sweet. Oh, look at that. We've got, like, uh, freaking... <laughs> We're going to have a little, like, uh, what, they, what do they shoot? Acid, that's it. I was going to say spice. Shoot spices. They shoot acid out. When you just hold it, we're crabbing them, like, spin out. That'd be hilarious. We got little spice shooters. All right, I'm going to take these to that base then, and then I'll come back, and um, I'll probably just grab a whole bunch of these. We have loads of eggs, so we can breed them. Uh, I do feel like, or I'm, I'm hoping that Babylon do retaliate and try and come back for it. Uh, while we're over there, though, we will check out what is going on with their base. I'm not sure, like, how fortified it is. So this could be uh, interesting to see what we need. We'll see if we need a rock elemental or not. Hopefully we're not. We've got these little little guys now. They're going to destroy the base. Oh, we dropped one already. Good job. This is going to be fun. <laughs> All right, we're back. Um, one of them died. I am actually... I can see why people don't use these. Literally, just going from here to here... Every creature wants to attack him. Everything aggroes to me. And we jumped and landed on top of a Rex and he demolished it like... I can't even remember what level it was, but he demolished it so quickly. So we've got one. Uh, that's going to just have to chill there. Uh, we are just going to jump down here, see what the situation is. See how many creatures we're going to need to bring. Um, hopefully it's not too many because it is a ball lake maneuvering creatures on this game. I cannot wait until they do Arc 2 or something and just fix that. Because that is like one of my most hated things about this game. Is trying to go around with a group of creatures. It's so frustrating. <laughs> okay, I forgot did we we sink into the water. Do they have any defenses at all? I think it's literally just a box. Okay, that means we won't need a rock golem. Pretty sure once we attack it, they're going to bring a, a couple of rock golems. Yeah, it looks like it's just a, a freaking box. Now, let me check, because a lot of these times, it's it's my stuff. Okay, it's Babylonian. That's cool. All right, so let's get back up there. We'll go back. I'm just going to bring loads. I just want to bring so many creatures. Uh, from what I've seen in chat, it looks like there's at least one or two of them online right now. So I'm pretty sure they'll fight back, because it's pretty close to their area. I'm sure they'll come and try and fight back. Uh, obviously... We don't want to leave that base too 
Black Hat base back up there. Too weak and vulnerable without them creatures if they all die. So we'll take a good handful. But we'll also leave some there. So if they do like retaliate and try and take that base then... It's still well defended, even though we do have loads of eggs to hatch, which we can do if we uh, if we fail this. But uh, I'm feeling good. I feel like we can actually uh, destroy their base today. Let's hop back up here. Hopefully, I can leave you. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to like uh, I don't know where I, I was a minute ago. I'm going to put my stuff on this crab, kill myself, so I can spawn back in that base, so I don't have to travel all the way with this guy. Because <laughs> I am so smart. Big brain equals big pee pee. Alright, run away. It is super loud. We've got the whole freaking army. We've got you, Tyrannus, Rexes, Spinos. I've brought a couple of Kentros with us. Uh, I'm pretty sure a lot of you is going to be left behind, but uh, I feel like this should be more than enough to deal with whatever they're going to throw us. Even if they throw, like, maybe four rock golems, I'm pretty sure this army could take them on once they've leveled them all up. So I'm going to try my best to get most of them back or over there. And then I'm, I may, may just like run back and like pick up all the ones they get left behind. Because I'm sure a bunch of them will be stuck on trees and rocks and stuff. Uh, I can't even see the Kentros are behind us. Um, I, we've got a hyena done down there somewhere. Uh, Allosaurus. I see one Kentro. Oh, God. Yeah, maybe don't do that, Terror Bird. <laughs> oh, God. I'm not sure why stuff's attacking us. Could you imagine a stupid terror bird being like, you know what, I'm going to go and fight this massive huge armor. And raptors as well, beautiful. Stupid, there's so much going on! <laughs> oh god, there's more raptors. Let me get on summit. Not everything has a saddle. Okay, I can't see shit now. Oh my god, what's happening here? Kill a Bronto. Th this is my view right now. <laughs> oh, God. All right, are we all good? All right, I'll bring it back once we, uh, once we get over there. All right, so we have the army here now. So I believe everything made it. Um, I'm pretty sure. So I'm going to get everything to follow us. We're going to jump off the edge. And um, so we'll destroy the f we'll destroy as much as we can first. Oh, you human, get out of here. We'll destroy as much as we can of the base first, and then uh, we'll take the flag, and then I'm pretty sure the um, the Babylonians... Oh, my God, I can't see. The Babylonians will try and uh, defend it. But, yeah, let's uh, let's get over here first. All right, I see their base. Could you imagine if uh, a Babylonian was just chilling there right now, like, just strengthening their defenses? <laughs> and this massive army just appears. It's very pink. They'll definitely be able to see us if uh, they're around this area. So I'm going to get them all set up here. Uh, I'm hoping the centipede's in this uh, place somewhere. So if we get them all chilled here, uh, we have a kangaroo following us, which I'm pretty sure is not my kangaroo. Okay, they've got a sweet. Uh, guys, make sure you're coming over here. I'm going to leave that there. Okay, Mr. Afro. You really fan heather. We just maybe, you know what? We're going to pump some more melee damage into you. All right, let's start destroying it. Uh, let's have everything on neutral just for now. So I'm probably going to destroy as much as I can. And then once there's a couple foundations left, we'll take the flag. Although I'm pretty sure to get to destroy them, we have to get like pretty much inside. But yeah, as soon as we capture this flag, guarantee they, uh, they come and scout first. I'm pretty sure they will come and bring a little uh, Deinonychus. But then they're going to see his whole army and be like, oh, okay, maybe I don't want to fight that yet. And then they'll end up bringing a whole freaking army and we can have a big massive fight. <laughs> you know what we should have done? We should have hit these and then brought them out. Hmm, I might seem to do that. Because they're going to literally come down this way here and then bring us armor. Okay, I'm just going to move. Yeah, we're just going to move a couple of these, I believe. Why can I not whistle? Oh, there we go. Just a couple of them. And like maybe just even if we just bring them up here. Because I'm pretty sure they're not going to come from this way. I mean, I don't really want them all the way over there. But that's cool. Okay, so if we just like bring them here. Maybe some more of these. Because by the time they bring that army round. Yeah. This is going to be a good idea. I feel like they... Because they, they'll probably see us and be like, okay, they've only got... 
seven Rexes, we'll just bring whatever instead of bringing a whole massive armor. See, this is tactical thinking right here. I wish more of these would actually listen to me and follow me when I whistle at you. I definitely prefer this over the Rock Golem. Although it's a pain to get around the map. Uh, if we do find a really high level one, I prefer eating stuff for this because you can hit multiple at the same time. I don't know. I just feel like it makes quick work of it. The Rock Golem has to wait for stamina. It's a slow attack. We do it pretty rapidly. And as soon as the health comes down on these structures, which we'll probably do soon, then these are going to be an absolute breeze to get through. And it makes it like more people are going to want centipedes. So the fight up north may become a bit more. Is still damaging stuff? Okay. Uh, I'm going to bring you here because I kind of don't want to lose you. Alright, so we're going to destroy all of this stuff. We were going to just do a little bit, but I feel like we're going to do it all because one of them wants to build some sort of water pen around here. So we're going to take it. And then I guess we prepare for the fight. So what I'm hoping is they come down that ramp like they normally do. Maybe with a little spy. See just these couple of stuff here. And not realize that we have a whole freaking army up here. Which they all seem to have freaking moved. God damn it, stupid heads. Like, seriously? Could you wanna not just stay where I will put you? <sighs> Why have you got a Rex up here? What are you doing, bro? You good? Can you come back down here? I really don't want him to see that. <laughs> come back here. They really do take the hard way, don't they? I think we're going to go ahead and see if we can take these two here as well. They should be able to bait them out. Is that a... Is that a play kangaroo? I'm pretty sure it's not. <laughs> do the raw! There we go. Look at that. 632. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. I like that. Right, once we get this destroyed then, we'll bring all these dinos over. We'll, uh, we'll go take some more land. I'm pretty sure the Babylonians will have to come out and try and stop us then. Because we're going to be taking a lot of their land. Getting our own back. There we go. All freaking destroyed. Yeah, way better than the golems. Spikes are all good. Okay. Right, we need to move then. Uh, so we're going to go over to this next one, I guess, and we'll just see what Oasis is there. All right, they've literally just took that one that we just got. Oh, my God, I'm going to have to run all the way back down there. Wait, how did we get down? Dino, stop. Ugh. Okay, we need to go back down. Right, everyone back down. Everyone back down. We're all coming back down now. I'm just going to be stuck on every single creature, of course. Okay. <laughs> we'll go back and kill them. Oh, we captured the flag at least. And let's bring the armor. Wait, which one did we just get? Okay, we caught it back, which means they must be on their own. Okay, majority of the army is this way. They are about. I love it how literally we just leave and then they come back. <laughs> I knew they would. Are they on anything? Huh. Hey look, we saw someone's feather light. I love that. <laughs> we'll look after the feather light for you. Um, okay, apparently they're on a Deinonychus somewhere. So they're like scurrying around. Alright, um... Oh, they see us. How does one get up there? <laughs> I'm going to just leave my army there, chilling. Let's want to see if we can grab this. How the shit do we actually get up there? What the crap? Do we have to go like, all the way around? How did he get up there? All the way down here? God damn. <laughs> that was a, that's a pretty good place to put a flag. I want to take credit and say I put it up there, but I'm pretty sure I didn't. Okay, apparently there's a Danonychus here, checking them out. Obviously, we don't want the Danonychus to attack our Arthro. There they are. I see them. Get out of here, you! I'm speedier than you. Yeah. That's what I thought. <laughs> you get out of here! 
Are you coming back? You wanna go? Do we do more damage or do they? <laughs> Keep biting them! What, what's that red eye thing? Why have we got red eyes? Oh, I definitely do more damage. We find to the death. Kinda wanna drag them down to our other dinos. That's it, follow me. Follow me! Oh god. I'm bringing them. Get them! <laughs> they know my dinos are down there. Found a box. Have got any good stuff in it? Fire arrows? A pike? Hyena saddle? A little bit of armor? No, I might take that. Might need that. May need that a little bit. I'm probably going to whack that on now. That's a lot better than the armor I have. That's just in case we get stuck. And then we've got uh, two fire arrows. Just in case we need them. May scout out the next one. See if we can grab the next... Uh, see if we can grab the next flag. Oh, I see the flag. It looks like it's in our temple. Huh. You know what? I'm going to capture this one if we can get in there. We can. Taking this one then, because this is in ours. <laughs> They've obviously just jumped in it and caught it like this. Boom. What are you saying, Babylonians? They said I was scared from uh, running away from them. They have no idea I was trying to lure them into that trap of dinos. <laughs> no idea. Right, let's get back to them then. Ow. That hurt. Pretty sure they've got to be mustering up some sort of force right now. There they are again. Found you. Get out of here. Stop spying. Yeah. I saw you spying there. Do have some arrows we can shoot if we want to. Jesus. Oh, God. Okay, we don't do as much damage at all. Oh, yeah, can we get them? Oh, did we get it? Oh, we killed it. Oh, no, that's boom. Oh, wait, what? What died? I'm so confused. Did the Deinonychus die? What just happened? Why did everything just happen so quickly then? No, the, the kangaroo's there. Kangaroo, come back. Kangaroo, stop. Okay, you know what? Attack my target then. Is he on it yet? <laughs> okay, let's see if we can lure him down to uh Are they after us still? Oh, I don't want his kangaroo to die. Is he on it yet? He must be on it. Oh god! Oh god, raptors! Oh god, raptors! Oh shitting tits! Oh dick slice! Ow! <laughs> that hurts so much! <laughs> Ouch! Of course, raptors. It's always raptors. Where did they go? Okay, my helmet broke. Hey, good job I had this armor. <laughs> oh, they're still there. Still there. Okay, kind of want to shoot a fire out at them if I can. Oh, they got a whip. Stop! Stop eating me! Oh, they down? How are none of these hitting you? There's an arrow in your head! Still none of these have hit. Are you shitting me? How? Have none of these hit yet? What? What is this bullcrap? I don't understand how none of these arrows have hit. Oh, they're bloody. They're definitely bloodying up. Oh, it may be a, maybe a final stand between me and this Deinonychus. Come on, Blaze! You can do it! You can do it, Blaze! Come on, Blaze! No, there's another kangaroo! Oh, is it dead? It's dead! Yes! Yes! Please, good job! You didn't die! 
Oh, guys, a raptor! Uh, we've got him naked. <laughs> we've got him naked. Got him. Now there's a kangaroo here. Oh, the feather lights there. I didn't mean to. Is the bag and stuff still there? Okay, we're not gonna take any of their loot. There's no point. Oh, it's a red drop here. I think I'm gonna go and grab this. <laughs> Let's see if we can grab this red drop. Is there any good stuff in here? Oh, some arrows and a compound bow. Sweet. Is that better than my current compound bow? Uh, chat, get out of the way because I can't see. Uh, it is. Nice. Got some more arrows as well. We've got some good boots. Sweet. Look at that. Getting good shit. Okay, we just captured another freaking flag. We are like full on going into uh, Babylonian territory right now. <laughs> I feel like this is a big push. Oh wait, he needs to die. I was just making sure that person could get the bag. We, we said they could have it. Alright, so we're secure. Well, we're secure in this uh, second one right now. So I'm just going to go and chill on the beach a little. I feel like they may come back for revenge. Although, they only had the Deinonychus and uh, the Kangaroo to attack us. Which I find a little strange. Because they're normally the type that bring a whole ass armor. And they've not done that yet. And I'm kind of shocked, like, why haven't they? <laughs> I thought they would have been here straight away to take this, but they just didn't really seem to care. So I'm just going to chill here for, I don't know, uh, 10, 20 minutes. See if anything else goes on. Otherwise, I think that's a pretty successful episode. We managed to actually catch four bits of land, but we'll probably work on defending these two first and then move over to that one. Um... Oh, okay, we're probably getting that one again. I did just tell the tribe, I was like, look, we don't need to grab any more of their land, but <laughs> I'm guessing they're not listening. I'm not sure why we need that bit. <laughs> All right, what we're going to do then, it looks like they're not going to attack because they've been here a little while. So we're just going to go and put all of these dinos in that tunnel. Uh, apparently we have a base in there, apparently there's a lot of uh, aggressive dinos, so we're just going to leave more in there and then if the place does get attacked, we can bring all of these out and destroy what's ever over there. Uh, hopefully, <laughs> we'll have to let everyone know that that's the plan. Now, normally when I leave uh, an area, this is where we get attacked. So, I'm just waiting to see a big army of stuff come down that ramp. That I've been waiting for all day. I miss seeing that. Okay, Kentro's are a little bit slow swimmers. I always hate, like, these simple humans here. It, like, legit looks like an actual person. I'm always there, like, wait. <laughs> is that an actual person? No, I think there's a little one up here. Okay, so we'll uh, yeah, we'll whack all of these up here. Make sure they're all on like uh, neutral or attack my target or whatever. So if they do get hit, they're all gonna run out and eat someone's face. And we're all gonna be attacking some apparently. Killed Lordy, 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 Lordy. All right, this probably do. This is probably deep enough. You all coming in? Yeah, it seems like most of them... Oh, no, we had, we had a few more coming in. We have a raptor in there for some reason. Oh, it's Ketra's follow me. Oh, Ketra's, come on. You did so well. Go this way. I love my little Ketra's. Look at him go. Holy shit, that you trying to scare the crap out of me. And the problem is they're... Oh, no, they're getting up. Just gotta go back and get the carcass, which I'll probably take back to. Uh... Oh god, we're stuck. I'll probably. Oh my god, somebody's stuck. We'll probably take. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> okay, we'll probably take that back to um, our actual base. He's in the water somewhere. Hopefully, that Arthur is not drowning. <laughs> right, I do want to do one thing. I'm gonna. Where's that hyena done? We had a hyena done somewhere. I'm gonna keep this hyena down. I'm going to use him as bait so we know when that base does get attacked. Uh, actually, you know what? I could just do it with the crab. So let me let me get on you. Let me just put you down a minute. Okay, hyena done. Come here. So we're going to name him whatever base this is, and then when it does get attacked and he gets killed, everyone will know that's the base that's been attacked, so they can probably get over there whilst... Um, they're like attacking the base rather than it already being taken over and then you're like wait what 
some time. Is there a raptor over there? Why did it look like there was... Oh, it was a horse. <laughs> it's just a random horse tune there. Oh, wait, hyena. I dropped you. I'm sorry. Come here. Nice. Make sure we're not being watched. We're always being watched by the Babylonians, but I feel like today we finally got our revenge. Okay, you come down. So this place is called 8-7. So you're going to be called 8-7. Get out of the way, horse. So he's called 8-7. Uh, we, I want you to sit down because you're cute. And I want your behavior. Mm, we'll put you on neutral. You're going to guard this place. So if you die, we all know. I'm sorry, Mr. Mr. Hyena Don. It's a sacrifice for the greater good. I'm sure that's the saying. Alright, so we'll call it a day there. So uh, we managed to get a little bit of uh, a skirmish on with the Babylonians. We took over some of the land. Uh, I feel like it's what I needed today. I just needed to kill someone. <laughs> in, in, in a video game, not in real life. Don't, don't take that wrong. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm sure there will be uh, repercussions for that. I'm awaiting the Babylonians' revenge plan. So if you did enjoy, don't forget to smash thumbs up button, subscribe, ring the bell, enable notifications, and thanks for watching. I'll catch you in a bit.